up guys, this is Casey at EVS. Wanted to give you a first look at the Blackmagic Cinema Camera. Off the bat, it's heavier than you'd think it'd be. We have a Canon EOS cinema mount, or a cinema lens rather, mounted onto this, so that's heavy as is, but the body itself is pretty heavy. It actually feels good. It's a solid camera for sure. The hood, easy to deal with. You just pull it off like that, and then again, it's a nice uh, flexible rubber. And then to put it back on, that's it. But again, when you hold it handheld, you'll see that the bevels on these doors actually dig into your fingers when it's on. So when you're holding it handheld, it's way easier without that hood. You have three quarter 20s on top. On the bottom of the camera, you get one quarter 20 with a guide pin hole. No 3 8 on the bottom of this. Also, uh, the actual fan ventilations down here. When this thing is on, you can actually feel the air kick out of it pretty, pretty strong. Solid state drive is right here. You open the door. You actually have to just put your fingers in there and pull out. And there's the drive right there. And then it pops right back in. Here's all your ports right here. So you got your remote port, uh, headphones, two quarter inch audio inputs, one full size SDI, uh, Thunderbolt, and your power. Let's go ahead and see how fast the boot time is. Let's hit the power button here. So camera's ready. I can actually hit record right now and it's, it's rolling camera up. So that's pretty quick. Let's go ahead and go to the menu. I like the keys a lot. They're all soft rubberized keys. They have a really good responsive click. So here's the four sub menus within the main menu. You have camera settings, uh, audio settings, recorder settings, and display settings. Quick little things here. The uh, ISO, right now it's 1600 to I believe 200, that's the only options you have. So it goes 1600, 200, 400, eight. So yeah. Uh, white balance, similar situation where you have all the, you know, the major presets, but they're not that discreet, the increments. So they jump a significant amount. Shutter angle, same thing. If you look, if you look at me cycle through it, you know, the increments are not that discreet. At least around here they are though. 144, 172, 180. What I like also about the menus, it's all touch screen, so to adjust like channel one input, to adjust channel one input, you kind of just put your finger over here and you, you drag it. Uh, they're both sliding right now because I have channel one linked to both, so if I just turn that off, I can now slide it and now one moves independently from the other. Recording, recording settings, you, have your, you can choose DNX HD, uh, RAW 2.5, and ProRes. Um, when you're in ProRes and DNX HD, you can change your dynamic range from video to film. Frame rates, frame rates you can choose on this camera, and no matter what uh, recording format you're in, you can choose 30, 2398, 24, 25, and 2997. Basic adjustments in your display settings, dynamic range, your brightness, again, it's kind of cool. You can just slide it in and out to show you know, how responsive that is. And then uh, the Zebra, you can change the amount of that from Typical settings here, hundreds the highest. So we can see our zebra right there. Very obvious that I'm blown out. Uh, the focus button, when you hit that, it actually gives you a peaking in white, which is really actually clear to see. Uh, you can't change the color right now. It looks like you'll, it can only be in white, but it's, it works really well. What I like about this camera, and it's pretty cool, the lens mount is really solid. It's a big metal flange, comes out of the body. You know, it's a, it's a very well-built mount. It's not chintzy at all. I have no problem mounting this lens onto it, you know, without any kind of support. Once again, guys, Blackmagic camera. This thing's pretty crazy, way out of the box. Never seen a camera like this before, and we'll definitely give you more in-depth videos coming up in the future. But for now, thanks for watching, and have a good one. Thank you.